to another video so with this a continuation of the list view the first one we studied the static list view and this one is going to be the dynamic list view where we're going to have data from api or simply going to generate our own data in this tutorial i have a list of countries we're going to use for this dynamic uh, list view so let's get started so as you can see the previous video you can check our previous video to know the source code here okay so in order to start this i want to clear everything in here and then we're gonna maintain the same function you're gonna maintain the same function but i will clean everything inside the function and uh, let me take off the return in the function okay good so <clears throat> okay so inside inside the function we gonna have uh, we gonna have oh let me clear this too okay so the function is empty inside the function we're gonna have uh, a data whereby it's gonna be an in, uh, input right in the function but this data is basically we get this data from a list of JSON or API where we can fetch data from yeah for the sake of this tutorial I have uh, a backing data as a list of countries where we're gonna use to uh, practice this dynamic what uh, list view okay so inside here I'm gonna add the data by creating a final <clears throat> a final list of countries so let's say uh, final some countries yes some countries I can list all the countries I'll use just a few of the countries okay so I call it some countries and then uh, some countries will be passed to this this square bracket okay square bracket okay so inside a square bracket it's like a normal a normal JSON data we have or we pass in some data from the server server side or API good but let's keep the data in here being generated by me so let me paste the data here so this is the list of the countries so I have a lot of countries in here so I have it in the what in the uh, variable variable some countries and then the variable is final okay because it doesn't it change so I go beneath this I create I I'm gonna create the the counter builder or the one that is gonna help us loop this uh, this countries inside our dynamic list view okay so to do that uh, let's return uh, this list view dot builder provided by uh, flutter list view list view dot builder this one yeah this function is provided by flutter and inside the list view the builder we can have a uh, we can have item item builder inside so for the item builder item builder can uh, have two no let me do it this way item builder should have um, let me clean this way we have a uh, i put two parameters here in item builder we will have the contest and then index since we're gonna use the index to pull out all these countries in the list view so I have a parameter of contest here contests yes and uh, after the contest we also have the index I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna add this to it the index where we're gonna fetch the index you see it right now okay then uh, let me add closing open and closing parenthesis and inside the parenthesis we're gonna return a uh, list style the list style we know how to do that in the other video so I just add that to it return list list style list star 
and the lister will simply return the uh, variable I have up there called the what the some countries final some countries here this one okay so in here we have the list are returning um, list are, okay then uh, we have a title inside title inside this title and the title takes a test widget so I return a title and the title will return a test widget okay test widget okay so the test widget will be the test in here will be our variable up there called some what some countries okay some countries and then it's gonna use what we call the array of what of numbers to pick all the countries and then display on the screen okay so inside here I'll have the index okay okay so inside here the the return list let me uh, define the item counter item counter this will help us list all what all the countries in that uh, variable call some countries okay so I have uh, some countries some countries uh -huh. dot length so it's gonna check the length and then return all the countries on the on the screen okay some countries dot what length okay all right let me look here ooh, 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 ooh. list how okay list how is here return list how okay list how. All right then we have a list view Oh, sorry, list view here. List view. Okay. So, list out in here. Uh, let me check this well. Oh, no. The list builder need to have the closing end here here instead the list builder should be here and then we should have uh, this one here okay good then I need to terminate this okay then what about this let me use uh, oh I don't have anything in here Mm. I need to terminate this and then this a comma and then I need to terminate this rather okay uh, let me cross check again so I have this this here one two three Okay, one is to which one? This is to this. Okay, this is to this. That is to
list builder is to this list builder then uh, this is for the index and then the listar the listar is here okay listar then uh, what else listar listar is here then we have uh, this contest okay i save i save this mm. oh yeah we have the test the test does not have uh, this okay boom perfect all right so now let me quickly go over again then uh, we finish this we have uh, the function get view which has already been being called here in the main and then the these are the data we're gonna feed inside our dynamic list view and then it's in a variable called some countries and returning is final or the variable is final and then we return a list view builder list view builder provided by flutter and then we have the item count and this item count will only check the variable and then dot it length it means how many countries inside right then we have the item builder the item builder would we'll take a contest and then the index so index of this and then return a list style list style means the display style and then it will return the title the title would take the variable and then the index of what the list of data we have in here good so i save and then i run on the screen Uh, okay good so now we can have the lists of countries right displaying on the screen okay so we're gonna add another video on a list view we we'll like you to subscribe and also check our latest video by turning on the notification bell peace we out